It's about 5.50. Mm. It's Sunday morning and it's the Lord's Day. And uh, what do you like it? Lovely cup of coffee this morning. The winds are blowing really good outside. About 30 knots. And 30 knots is, uh, I don't know, about 36 miles an hour. And it's blown steady. And it started yesterday afternoon and it really hasn't let up. The winds uh, make it so you can't do much welding outside and you also can't remove heavy material like uh, the upper walkways. Are... Come on, Grumpy. You got it, buddy. Keep going. And um, even so, we're able to take off about half of the north side upper walkway. And the reason we're taking it off is because it's getting kind of rotten. Uh, that's a necessity of uh, original engineers didn't really quite follow the design that they were supposed to. And that's okay. Um, it really has encouraged us to think outside of the box, no pun intended here, um, but to put solar panels hanging down uh, on the sides, just like awnings uh, on a on a housetop. I like that all the way around. Uh, we've gotten nine of them up on the uh, northeast side, and we just put up nine of them on the northwest side. We've got tabs on the southwest, and we took the solar panels that you'll see in the videos that are directly on the helipad up there. We took all those off so we'd get more of that walkway off. And the panels we're going to put back are going to be more of the Silfab Solar 400 watt panels. So as I uh, give myself a little bit of black powder this morning, check out their vacuum canister if you get online. It actually does a great job of keeping it really fresh. We're going to have to do some kind of work that does not get us outside in this strong wind with the plasma torch and whatever. Might be able to do it, but the problem is, is again, you can't hang heavy things in the wind. So it's just too dangerous moving around. We could always uh, build more solar panels, uh, the assemblies with the brackets and everything. And we could work on, uh, there's some lighting that we need to fix inside. Uh, there's a closet that needs to be cleaned out. And I've got to prep and get all the signature solar equipment that we got. Uh, get some Victron, V-I-C-T-R-O-N. Uh, that will be the charge controllers and the actual inverters. And that's a lot of technical stuff before I drink some coffee, so. Yeah, that's good. Hmm. I got a little bit of uh, video time lapse of us working on putting on solar panels. I hope that came out. If so, I'll get that uh, thrown up online. And um, we've got about seven or eight volunteers here total. And I got to tell you, we're having a blast. We're eating like kings. Um, some people love to cook. And uh, some people don't mind cleaning. And everybody likes to eat. So, out of those three options, you got to do two, two of them. So, cook and eat. Eat and clean. I guess you could cook and clean, but nobody's doing that. Uh, it's Sunday a day or so before the uh, election. And I just wanna encourage you to get out and vote if you haven't already. Uh, you have a voice and rather than complaining about politics, do something about it. All you gotta do is make your voice known. Have a good discussion with people. No one is evil and crazy and there's no dictators or liars or well, maybe a few liars, but uh, you know what I mean? Talk to people, have a meal with them. And you'd be surprised how much you do have in common. Like family. Like America. Like good coffee. So remember, be nice to somebody you do not like. It's not hard nowadays in this political climate. It messes with their head and lets them know that somebody actually does care about them. And tell those that you do care about how much you care about them while you can. While you still have time. And while they'll listen, please drink some good coffee. Mmm. Mmm. Like the frying pan towers blend from black powder. Look, hot thing. That's some good stuff. Go have a good day. Be blessed. Coffee. Coffee.
Bye.